Hi again, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro in just a moment. I'm Mike Emery. It is the end of a long homestand, and so far it's been a positive one. They have a winning record and all, but it ends tonight. How do you approach a game that's the last one? Well, you want to continue the positive momentum that you started at home here, Doc, and I think for this particular team is that when you get back on the road, you want to live off of what you've done in your last game. They want a big win here tonight. The Stars are taking care of business here at home. We talk about how important it is to win your home games because it's difficult to win on the road. Let's see if they can go out on the road with a win in their pocket, winning the last game of this homestand. And now we turn to the last lines of defense. The goalies gave his team a chance to win last time, so he's out there this time. Ryan Miller is in goal from that illustrious family. No fewer than 10 members have played hockey at Michigan State. Ryan was the goalie in the first outdoor game at Spartan Stadium back in 2001 and in the first Winter Classic in Buffalo. Tyler Sagan, what a rookie year. Won a Stanley Cup with Boston, blew into Dallas, and posted three 30-goal seasons right away. He's just got the knack. That was a big hit. Looks like he arrived at the rink in a bad mood. Maybe he missed his wake-up call. That early hit is an angry one. Crosses that line. Fires. Say. Gets a little drop off from the goalie here. Strong play there. Gathered up again by Perry. Good job defensively done there. That takes some pressure off with that defensive play. Receives that pass from the other side. Went to the backhand. Puck loose. Strong defensive play by Perry. Anaheim's looking to head man up the wing. Makes that play deep. Puck grab. They've got it ready. Using the point. In that defensive zone, an important play. They get it out, and that is a relief to the coach and the players. Let's it go. Turned aside with a pad. Laid on to Zuccarello. Good save there. Up to the point. Throws it. Got to clear it. The Ducks have it along the side at mid-ice. Muscled off. Right up the middle through the neutral zone. And he hatchets one. Got in the way of that one. Play stopped. It's Ray Ferraro time. You gotta love when you play against a rival, whether it's a new one or a traditional one. But when you play in your conference, each game is so important. Thanks very much, Ray. That faceoff is one. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. He missed the net. Wicked shot there, Doc. Very important steal for him. Good job done with the stick. Way to break up that play. Dallas gates upwards along the side. Slid to Lindell. He had a great chance, but he has just missed the net. When you shoot the puck that hard, I don't know if you have to lean into it that much. you got to get it on the net to give yourself a chance. The Ducks with a face-off win. That's a pass ahead. Wow, what force in that one. The physical play in this game has really picked up, and there's a perfect example of that. Chip to Ritchie. Scooped up by Del Sato. Pass attempt to Ritchie. Steps in from the neutral zone. In all alone. Wide of the net. Off target goes wide. Great job on a cut pass. Hmm. 
shot. Great save, point blank. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Canes that offensive line. There's a shot that's way wide. I'm sure he meant well. Oh, he was trying to be too cute with that shot. You cannot miss the net that badly. Back to the point. Let's it go. May not have intended it, but it hit it. And he puts the glove on it and stops play. Ryan Miller's career has been largely fashioned with one logo, and that of the Buffalo Sabres. He is the winningest goalie all-time in the history of a franchise that goes back to 1970. And they've had some pretty darn good goaltenders in Buffalo. Dominic Hasek, Tom Barrasso, Ryan Miller sits at the top of that mountain. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. The Stars win the draw. Drives it. And a save. Quick wrist shot. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. And a save. Now oh, there's a little bit of a luck involved there. The goalie was screened on the play. He couldn't see it, but he stopped it. Point to point. That attack shot right down. Forks it to Klingberg. Heaves one. Wonderful save. Some contact there, and the puck is loose. Collected at the boards. Pass across at the point. Oh, he got in the way of that one. It's blocked. The puck heads to neutral zone. And look, it's just like a magnet. Everybody goes there. Got it in his own end. Cut that pass in his own end. Picks it up in his own end. Fires. Oh, and it's off the mark. That's what I would call a grade-A scoring chance, but the shot just missed the target. That puck is loose. No luck getting through that. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. And a save. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Good job on the draw. And now it's directed to Pitlick. The Stars gated up on the side. Superb hit. A great hockey play there. Raquel's going to have to pick himself up after that one. He got steamrolled. They clearly got the target on him. Oh, how can they miss that pass? Smart recovery by Perry. Gathered up by Tyler Sagan. Carries it on in from center. Skill play by Henry. Outstanding body contact. I once had a coach tell me, hit or be hit. There's an example of getting yourself into the game. Dallas isn't known as a skilled team, yet they've been very physical here early in the game, trying to create some offense with the body. Anaheim's got it off the draw at center. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. They keep working hard on the boards. Good defensive play, hand to eye and center ice. A slot wrister made that stop. All the new styles of jerseys, shirts, hats, and other collectibles.
The Ducks prevailing on the faceoff. Shoots one. Skilled play by Ben. Brings it in for an attack. Fires. He scores! Well, they jumped up on the bench beside me pretty quickly here. Very excited on the one side to have the game's first goal. Dallas has been able to score the first goal of the game. Took a while, but they have it. A little under three minutes remaining in the period. The Stars lead 1-0. Dallas carrying it up the wing. Shoots. Outstanding save with a glove. 17 minutes, 8 seconds. They win the draw. What next? Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Puck comes out of the zone, back to center ice, and so things will settle a bit. Dogged determination there by Como. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Collected by Suster. Looking to Delzato. Around the 20th minute of this period. Loose puck knocked away by Como. In the first period. Directing that one to Cogliano. Somebody straight across. Puck has to be first. Offside. They've won the faceoff. Let's it go. Wonderful stop. Shoots one. Perfect tip by the stick. Look out. Here it comes. He did not expect to get hit right there. That is a big hit. Puts one on. Save there. And freezes play for the whistle. Way too slow at developing two on one. That gives time for the goalie to get across to make an easy stop. Solid, clean win. 20 minutes have come and gone. A rest for the players as we prepare for period number two. Dallas got the only goal in this one thus far. First period shots on goal, pretty lopsided. An impressive 15 for the Stars, five for the Ducks. The difference in the game is just one goal, and it came late in that period. Will it springboard to something more in the second? We'll see, but for now, we go to break. For you the locker room tour, membership is free. So what are you waiting for? Join our team. One period played, a second period is about to begin. What do you think of what we've seen so far? Ducks didn't play with the puck much in that first period. It's reflected on the scoreboard. They'll need to gain more possession time in order to generate more chances and turn things around. Taken over again. Loose puck. The defense got in the way there. Goes backwards. In with it now. To the point it comes. Great save. Anaheim's winging it at neutral ice. Puck loose now picked up. And he steps across the line. A shot. Oh, and he robbed him. Anaheim's goaltender's been outstanding. They're lucky they're still in the game, as this is still close. As soon as the shooter drops his head to release the puck, he's already in the butterfly, and so he can turn that aside easily.
Anaheim's prevailed on another faceoff. To Henrique. Puck is thrown to Haskin. Is able to move on in. Flings it. Didn't miss by much. If you don't hit the net, you can't score. Give yourself a chance by getting it on the net. Got that pass in his own end. He's got it. Uses the stick to cut off the pass. Dallas's team play has forced another turnover in this tight game. Solid work there by Jason Spezza. Has it picked up. Pitching it to Montour. Gathered up again by Henrique. Great defensive poke. Muscled right off it. Moving it to Zuccarello. Gains the zone. And they've got it again. The Ducks have the puck at center ice. And he steps across the line. Say, couldn't get his way through. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. Whistle is blown, and the guilty party heads off the ice. The Stars are boxed on a tripping minor. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. Anaheim special teams will have their first chance of the game. Oh, you get your power play on the ice for the first time. You can really generate some momentum, whether you score or not. Have a positive power play. Five minutes, 35 seconds. Leads that charge into the zone. Ah, they should have done better on that pass. Now everybody has to go back. Oh, he'll pay for that. And so a fight has begun, sort of. One guy refuses, so now we have another. This teammate did not want anything to do with dropping his gloves, and he's got some help. Received fighting majors. Both those guys making their way over to the penalty box. They're going to get a chance to cool down for at least five minutes each. Oh, that was a grueling scrap. They're going to get a chance to rest for five minutes. A little over six minutes play. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's one nothing. Solid win at center ice. Now what? Let's it go. Goal! A terrific short-handed goal. Small turnover, one bad read, and it's a shorthanded goal against. That's a backbreaker. The Stars have heavily outshot the opposition here, and they have a two-goal lead to show for it. Anaheim's got that one. Now what? Puck loose, couldn't get through. Propel to Raquel. The goal. Perfect pass! Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. Equal to the challenge. Nice stop. The Ducks win that faceoff. A shot! Hung right over him and couldn't get it passed. And he lets it go. Big save with a glove. I think it changed direction there.
Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Anaheim's quick on the draw. Passing one off now to Cogliano. Can start the attack going in the zone. Good place to shoot from. And a save. Terrific poke check. The Stars with the puck heading up ice from the boards. He pulled it right back. That one came back over the blue line. Everybody has to get back. And the coach wishes he had skates on right now. The Stars killed it all. Full strength now. Tries to get it on net. Oh, came so close. Just a bit wide of the target. On to Getzlaff. Blue line controlled. The pass is off the mark. What a chance that would have been. Turned a shot on net. The pad came in handy that time. Trying to go to Lindell. Pitching this one to Nechuskin. It's an onside play. Snaps one. A wonderful scoring chance denied. Terrific determination by Jason Spezza. Takes that pass from the other point. A lot outside. Didn't go very well there. Who comes up with it? Pressure now. Terrific fake. He had the goalie beat and hit the iron. Trailing in the game, you need a lot of things to go right for you to get back. Score! They're back to within one. Bishop's presenting himself pretty largely here. However, there's still room for the puck to beat him. The Ducks are only one goal behind, so they've gotten themselves back into this game. Perhaps they can tie it before the end of the second. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. On three, Pace. Time of the goal, 10 minutes, 30 seconds. This is tiring labor. Solid defensive position there. Went to the backhand. What a terrific save. Right on his stick. Can he get it out? Terrific determination by Jamie Benn. Shot on. Wonderful stop. Nicely received at the point. Sends it across the blue line. Lobs it. It's blocked. it back. Makes a shot. Gets a blocker on it. That one's right on his stick from the right side. Picks it up back there. Long lead pass to Faxa. Play goes, and he fired a shot, and it seemed late. They have to answer that play. That was not smart at all. was going back into old times for those two major penalties. This is old-time hockey. Every whistle invites a scrum. Guys seem to be more involved punching each other in the nose than they are trying to score a goal. Under seven minutes remaining. Anaheim's just scored. Let's see if there's momentum here. The Stars control from the neutral zone. Snapping a pass to Cogliano. Driving in from no man's land. Say! That's the end. Good work by Eves. Laid on to Cogliano. Slid to Suster. Puck picked up here. 
Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Oh, he saw the window open, but he didn't even touch the curtain. Boy, this puck had a lot of steam on it, but unfortunately, he turned his hands over, and that's what caused the puck to miss the net badly. Save there. Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie said no chance. That's an excellent save. Big face-off win. He was standing in the lane and got some of them. Has that point pass as well. From the outside. Just missed high. Not a free puck now. Hammers one. Did what he's paid to do. I'm generally a guy that's entertained by lots of goals and low score. Zuccarello's quick flick of the wrist put this puck in from the high slot. Miller's a goaltender that can be beaten up over the shoulders. He closes down the bottom of the net head zone, but this time they beat him up over his shoulders right near the elbow. Dallas has gotten a two-goal lead, and we are late in the second period. Great potential for a wonderful third. The Ducks with a center ice faceoff win. Steps across that line. Then Lovejoy, and by number 30, Ken Fisher. Time of the goal, 16 minutes. Through the corner now. Four seconds. A great wrist shot. Great save. Fans, please show this again. A puck covered whistle blow. The stars host the Minnesota Wild. Tickets are still available at the ticket booth or online. Well, the goalie will take these website. all day. His save percentage goes up. Click, click, click with muffins like this to stop. Under three minutes to go in the second. The Stars have scored three of the four goals. The Ducks win it. Let's it go. That move not too slick there. Good shooting place. Score! And it's a one-goal game. gives up on this play. The first shot doesn't go in, but he gets his own rebound and he lights the lamp. Alexiak's usually pretty responsible defensively, but he gets caught wandering up along the wall, opening up a shooting spot. Anaheim's deficit now is only one, and there's still time to go here in period number two. The Ducks from the neutral zone start to work. Anaheim's controlling play now up the wing. Has it back deep. And he motors on through the neutral zone. Close in play. Stared him down and made the save. His perfect positioning allowed him to shut down that chance. Nearing the last minute of this middle period. Pass attempt to Ben. Wheeling behind and continuing to move. A gong shot there. And now it's directed to Gibbons. He's in. Shot on goal. Score! Not much time left, but enough for that one.
Coaches won't have to say anything now. Their team will be pumped up that they've scored this last minute goal going into the intermission. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. Assisted by number 67, Rickard Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. All right, time to turn to the shots on goal and look at some impressive totals. 29 for the Stars and 16 for the Ducks. If you'd like to rub shoulders with some of our players, don't forget to go to our website and check out our next... Gibbons' goal has made this a tie game at the end of the period we had to break. Coaches probably said, who's going to get me that tiebreaker? Maybe they'll say, who's going to get me the OT winner? Puts one on. Great save. Save. He scores! dangerous once you break in time that you would sit back and try to protect the lead. I think you have to stay aggressive and play in the other end. Dallas has broken the tie. Not a lot of time left. We're in the third period, but plenty of time for heroics. The Ducks get it off the faceoff. Puck loose, just a speed bump off the defense. Chip to Klingberg. A shot. Missed the net. Oh, man, that's frustrating when you're watching from the bench and a player's got a great A chance and he doesn't even get a shot on that. Nice work with the stick. Poked it right away. And the pickup. Great block, and he's able to just keep it working. Bad luck. Broken stick. Oh, what a block in that shot. He stood right into it. That puck exits the zone, so play has to reset. And it's a good pickup. All the pressure still on as they can't clear. Great job on a cut pass. Oh, snaps the shot. What a save. I was looking for the light to come on. Never satisfied. Never take your foot off the gas pedal. He's got two goals now. He better be thinking about getting number three. Over three minutes skated here in the third. From a tie game, we now have a leader. Anaheim's got a face-off win. Looking to Raquel. Anaheim setting up an offense from the wing. Has that measured? The Stars have forced another turnover, Doc. They've done a real nice job in that category in this close game. Gets that one on a cross. Didn't handle it very well. Free puck. Slides it to the point. Shoots one. Oh, and a big save grab with the glove. He froze that just for a break. Miller's quick thinking allowed him to stop the play to slow down the pressure. Defensive zone win. And he picks it up. The Ducks up the wing, luck the puck. Perfect spot! That's terrific goaltending. Looked like the net was open for a second, but he shut it down. Gathered up again by Cogliano. 
Fox is back in the game after serving that five-minute major for fighting earlier. We'll see if the score's been settled. Anaheim's on the move in their own end. Walking a thin line near the border there. Sends to the point. What a shot, but high! You want to score goals, you got to get to the front of the net. That's exactly what happened, but unfortunately, just shot the puck over the net. Got his pad on that one. He's got that pass at the point. Great block! Recollected. Out at the blue line. Knocked off the puck. And for every action, there's a reaction. When you make a play like that, usually the end result is this. The decision of the referee is final. It was worth five each for fighting. You almost forget that they're going to keep track of the game by score here. The players seem to want to settle a score on every whistle. Much safer up here with you, Doc, in the booth. Five minutes for fighting for those guys. For seven minutes off the clock here in the third. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one goal contest. Puck covered, whistle blown. Clean win on the draw. Propelled to Kessler. Fantastic poke check. And he missed it. Nice work by Como. Just missed the net with that one. Got it at the point. Sends it across the blue line. Presses that attack. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. Setting it up. Sends a howitzer. He scores. Two straight goals. Almost wrist shot was heavy and quick. He looked like he was guessing a little bit there, Enzo, as he drops into the butterfly position. Not enough of the net cover. The Stars control at center ice. Whose puck blocked off by Getzlaff. Time of the goal. Now that pass has got to be better than that. Everybody has to get back. Directing that one to Nachushkin. Smart recovery by Getzlaff. Lifts the stick and robs him. Has it in his own end. The Ducks, through the neutral zone, glide along. Up that right side to Perry. Superb defensive play by Zuccarello. Gains the zone. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Wonderful work done near the blue line. Terrific shot block in the lane. Buck is thrown to Silverberg. Need to get rid of it. It's always way more fun when there's lots of goals in the game. The players like it. Well, the offensive ones do. The defensive ones aren't so crazy about it. But I will tell you who hates it. It's the coaches. They always want to have some control of the game. Pitching it to Alexiak. On to Jamie Benn. 
Tries to get it on net. Oh, what a save. He brought his best shot, and it got stopped. Looks ahead to start something. Dallas looking to head man up the wing. Let's it go. Gathered up again by Henry. Scooped up by Sagan. Loose puck. It went off one of the guys there. Walks the blue line. Shoots one. Had it away. Play stopped. That puck is just held. Dallas still has some work to do here tonight, but let's look ahead at their next few games, and guess what? It's going to be challenging, Doc. I've said it before, and I'm going to say it again. This is the most challenging schedule in all of professional sport. Nice face-off work. Moving it to shore. Skates it into the zone. And a save! Passing one off now to Pitlick. Let's it go. He scores. Three in a row. When you have puck support like that, it makes it a lot easier to play in the offensive zone. And when you do that, you're going to get rewarded. There's not much velocity left on that puck once it gets by the goalie. I thought he had it, guys. However, it ends up in the back of the net. Just a bit under five minutes to go. Do you see a pattern developing here? They're up now by three. And the faceoff's won. Scored by number 12, Radic Faxa. Assisted by number 18, Tyler Pickwick. Smart recovery by Lovejoy. Lost possession there. Strong defensive play. Back in his defensive end to get it. Can he generate something from there? Shoots. A great opportunity, but he missed the net. Oh, that puck slowed up. It just missed the side of the net. Richie slashed. Ooh, that's going to be a penalty. Johns will skate to the penalty box and sit for two minutes. The call is slashing. Oh, that's a blatant slash, Doc. Anytime that you slide your bottom hand up your stick and swing your stick, you're going to the box. The Ducks go on the power play yet again. Let's see how they perform. This power play needs an adjustment. I'm sure the coaches talk to the players about it. There's not much new to a power play. It works the same way all the time. You get a good zone entry, you get the puck to the point, you shoot it, you move the penalty killers around. Let's see if they can do it this time. Himes won that face off. The puck heads to neutral zone. And look, it's just like a magnet. Everybody goes there. The stars continue on in their own end. Trying to go to Cogliano. Puck grab, what's next? That's terrific work with the pad. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. As soon as the shooter starts to release this, the goalie drops to the butterfly. Hey, buddy, pick up your head. You might see he's down on his knees already. Anaheim's got a defensive zone win. The Ducks in their own end controlling the play. He's been on fire tonight. Two goals already. His teammates score! He's got the hat trick. And listen, the only ones you can hear are his teammates. Kasha rips home a slapper from the high slot. Well, the goaltender wants to be aggressive here, but this is just perfectly delivered. Anaheim 
Brown's goal gets them to within two. And we are in the third period. And there's still time for them to strike back. They've got the draw. Goal. His third of the game scored on the power play by number 25, Andre Cash. Goes back deep for it. Dallas charges up from the wing. Time of the goal, 17 minutes, 58 seconds. Makes that play deep. Approaching the final minute in this game. Anaheim's pulling their goalie for the extra man. Crosses that line. Net empty, and Cash is in. There's no doubt who'll win this game tonight after that empty netter. I'll probably put a bow on this one, Ed, so that'll be it. Neutralized face-off win. Puck free, roadblock by Perry. Reads the play and keeps it. Breaks free. Great work with the stick by Dan. Glove save. Nice. Directed up the wing to Radulo. Steps in from the neutral zone. Got it in his own end. Pitching this one to Sagan. Wonderful stop. Now that's a timely save. A beautiful one. It's dumped in. Gathered up by Lovejoy. Snapping a pass to Sagan. And so icing is whistled, and back it will come to the other end for yet one more face-off in this contest. And let's hear again from Ray. Kasho had an almost perfect night. Prominent since the puck has been dropped the very first time. Three goals in any night means you've had an almost perfect game. Thanks, Ray. Yeah, he has been remarkable in this game tonight. Fun to watch. Shoots one. The game is over. The Stars have collected yet another victory, and the chain gets longer. This team has been hot as of late. They are following their game plan. It's resulting in wins. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time... For Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.